Hello random internet stranger, I'm Michael, and in this video, we'll be looking at the progress I've made in my minigame collection, Animini Games. If you're new to the channel, or you haven't been following the development of Animini Games, then what are you doing with your life? Jokes aside, there's a link to the Animini Games playlist in the description, and with that, tap the subscribe button with your nose, and let's get into the video. I'll show you a couple of minor changes first. I moved the wall upwards a bit to fix the perspective. I fixed the music looper, the riser now transitions to the loop perfectly, instead of what it did before. Here's the code, if anyone needs it. What's that you just heard? A sound effect. But Michael, isn't that just supposed to keep the viewer engaged? No! It's supposed to be a segue to the next thing I've made. The sound effects... Ugh, just roll tape. Alright, after that surprisingly smooth segue, there are two types of sounds here. You've got the initial swish when you punch. And the sounds which play on impact. The AI now knows what to do when hit. Fly backwards, stop moving, and stop punching. The glove is grayed out as a visual indicator to the player, because unless the player is a dirty hacker, they won't know, will they? It's now time to strike the final blow, and watch as the AI majestically soars through the air. and watch as the dog does a kind of victory dance and the text appears, just in case you don't know what just happened. Stop for a moment because the pause menu is here. You're joking. You see you Simply press escape and the state of the art pause menu appears. It's so revolutionary that the whole world stops, transfixed in its beauty. Even the sound trembles before it. Yet all you can do with it now is press resume to put everything right. Don't know what they're in awe about, really. And that's it for today. If you liked it, please hit like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one in a fortnight. Stay tuned.